Hi, and welcome to our continuing series of tutorials using the Godex GoLabel software. The GoLabel software is free from Godex for all the Godex line of printer. We have a link in the description below. If you want to keep up with the latest videos, go ahead, do us a favor, and click the subscribe button and hit the like button. To get notified when new content is added, hit the bell. Also, feel free to drop us a comment below if there's a subject you would like us to show a video on. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so we're going to do a quick tutorial over setting up using the GoLabel software to print on the 1x4 pot stakes. That's going to be the item number, the Aurora Visual um, item number SXP 1045T. So when you first launch the GoLabel software, it generally comes up with what you see here. And so what we want to do first, and I always say, is I want to change my uh, measurements from millimeters to inches. And so as you click through there you, until you get to inches. So what you really want to do is set your page width up to 4.016 and this allows the printer not to default back to a lower uh, measurement and then the actual height is going to be one inch. As you can see there's a representation of this, uh, the measurements you just entered on the right in the box here label uh, ordering the preview there. So all the rest of this you can leave um, the same as the defaults are set and you go out to layout in the layout there's nothing to really change on this screen either so you can leave it pretty much the way you see it here and then you go into the media type um, tab and what we want to do is we want to change it from anything that it might default to like label with gaps or continuous we want to change it to label with marks and that's going to be the majority of everything that you use um, this software for it's going to be label with marks and here we want to set our width uh, let's make sure I got the settings correct here you want to set the width up to a 0 0.118 and so that that's going to be your width you don't have to worry about the top one up there you don't have to change it or do it anything just make sure that you've got the label with marks uh, set correctly and you should be set so now you see the box that represents the sizes that you entered into um, the settings and that's what you get on the screen so that's how you get your first setup ready to be printed. Then the next video will show you how to start entering uh, text onto your label uh, template that you've built. Hope to see you on the next video. Thank you for joining us.